Hovland man is being remembered as a gentleman and a beloved member of the community. This as his accused killer faced charges in court. The 82-year-old antiques dealer was found dead in his home this week. Katie Brace is in Groveland and shows us friends and family call him a renaissance man who did it all. The same day services began for Groveland's former building inspector, the man accused of murdering him appeared in court. The question remains for many, why would someone kill him? It helps, I guess, yeah, it would help. A week after longtime Groveland resident Pat Skeena was found murdered, police announced they arrested his killer. Family and friends arriving at the funeral home were still in shock. He's an 82-year-old guy, you know, that lived an honest life and then this happens, you just can't comprehend it. Hours earlier, Liddell Graham, who is 48 years old, appeared in court. Prosecutors say numerous surveillance cameras tracked him walking several miles from his Haverhill apartment to Skeena's. They say surveillance shows Graham entering the home around the time Skeena arrived. When Graham left, he dropped a bag. It contains a lamp that the state police uh, feel is the murder weapon. Investigators say Graham also stole a piece of jewelry. Skeena's best friend says the two met through his retirement hobby. It was um, through selling antiques. Before retiring, many in Groveland knew Skeena as a builder on the town's building inspector for 36 years. They all shared a similar sentiment. I get tears talking about him because he was a really good guy. Last time I remember him going by my house waving. Graham was released from prison three months ago after serving time for drug charges. He's also been imprisoned on weapons charges. Right now, he's held without bail. In Haverhill, Katie Brace, WBZ News.